what is up guys today i'm gonna be showing you how you can accept payments on wix for free okay now if you are selling products and you want to start uh you want to start uh, receiving payments for your products or services this video is for you now first thing you need to log in into your wix account and then you want to click on my sites in the top left and then you want to click on go to all sites okay now it will take you directly guys to all your sites as you can see here now as you can see you only have one site at the moment what you guys need to do to add to access payments you want to click on select and edit site now all you need to do guys is to wait a few seconds and you can link for example your paypal account or you can uh connect like you can link your stripe so that you can accept credit card payments now i'm gonna explain this to you in a few seconds now what you guys need to do you want to click on edit site in the top right and then it will take you directly guys to your site as you can see here now where you can customize the text of your site the templates like the the images we are not going to do that right now i'm just going to show you guys how you can add paypal or stripe to your wix um, website now what you guys need you will see this plus button in the top left in the top left here you just need to click on that and then you want to click on search okay if you click in the top here you will see search what you guys need to do you want to search for paypal now after you search on paypal you will find a lot of uh, options here it says here paypal button easily accept payments with a paypal button now we want to click on that okay it will take you directly guys to wix app market where you can download this uh, paypal button okay so that you can add your own paypal i'm going to be showing you how you can add your own paypal if you want click on go uh, add to site okay uh, click on agree and sold agree and add i'm sorry and as you can see we have added a paypal button to our wix website now what you guys need to do is to make it a little bit bigger if you want or you can make it smaller if you want just customize this as you want made with order as you can see here now what you guys need you can also add multiple buy button uh buy buy now uh buttons on here for example i have i am sitting for example it's just as like i'm going to put it somewhere here for example um let's say that this is a product as you can see here we are going to uh add buy now button here now you can also add it inside the, the product if you want inside the, the product page you can add this uh, buy button okay now if you are selling for example a service let's say that this is a service that we are selling you can just add here buy button and after that you can add multiple ones you can do the same step just go again and click on plus here search for paypal and then add it here again and then you can add multiple ones here now if you click for example here you will be able to click on settings now if you click on settings you can customize this as you want first it says here choose bottom type you can also either select uh, donate subscribe if you have if you, are, if you have like services that people will pay for them like uh, monthly you can uh, select like subscribe but if you have like a product or a service that you want to buy you want to sell i'm sorry you can select the first option just leave it as it is it says here buy now if you select donate it's going to change the donate as you can see donate now what you guys need to do now is to click on settings and it says here connect payments accounts click on that and you will have to enter here paypal uh, account email now you know you want to go to paypal and you want to enter your, your email okay that's the first step i'm going to enter the code here okay this is my paypal email you want to add it there okay and you can also like i said at the beginning add your stripe account to accept uh, like credit card payments and apple pay google pay and more okay or you can also also offer offline payments which is like cash on delivery and stuff like that uh okay so after you add here your paypal what you guys need to do you just need to click for example send me a verification email uh okay now you, if you if you click on send me a verification email like and a verification email is going to be sent to your email that's it okay you just need to click on that and then it will say it's verified okay now after guys you add here your paypal email just go back and if you click for example on uh ito responder email if you click on that you can send uh, it says enable ito responder 
uh, sent after a successful payment. If someone buys something for you, you will receive an email automatically. Okay, if you click on this one, it says here, thanks for your order. We have successfully received your order. We will be in touch shortly. Okay, you can also add here the, the payer name, the payer address. You can customize this as you want, okay? Now click on save if you want that. If you go back, you will find that redirect after payment. You can redirect these people to somewhere or another product on your website after you complete a payment. Like if you want to make more uh, sales, this feature, but this feature is only available when you upgrade, when you pay for the subscription of this app, okay? Now, if you click on back, you wanna click on, um, where it says here payment notifications, if you want to start uh, receiving uh, notifications. Like I'm going to leave you guys to uh, customize this as you want. If you click on products, you will find a lot of things here. Again, uh, design, you will find a lot of things. Other apps, you will find here a lot of apps, uh, other apps, okay? Now that's it, okay? Now this play, this buy button, if people click on that, it will, it, you will be able to buy your service, okay? So hopefully you guys, this video helped. If it does leave a like, subscribe. Let me know in the comments if this works. If you, please drop a like on this video. And like I said, you can always add this anywhere you want in your website. See you guys in the next one.